Welcome to boardshop.co.uk. It's board review time. This time we are looking at a PUCAS acid plan. These radically designed, radically styled new twin fins, but with a free fin setup, are now online at boardshop.co.uk. And these are very, very exciting for us and for you because these are very, very good to surf. Um, if you want to see them in action pretty much straight away, Stab have their electric acid surfboard test with Mason Ho and Coco Ho, where they both get given one of these in this kind of colorway as well, in this design, which is, I believe, done by Ruben, a great artist in Spain. And uh, they rip the bag out of it, and you can too, because this is not a difficult board to surf. Uh, just spinning around the board in its features, she's nice and flat. You got the uh, the beak nosed kind of template there with pretty low entry rocker, just a little bit of flip so you're not purling. Super flat through here and it's kind of single concave. And then it rolls into a double, and it, but it's a subtle double. It's not anything aggressive until about here, which gives you nice lift and drive and speed. And it works with the twin fin setup to give you that loose feeling, but it also gives you a lot of performance um, kind of a big key feature on this board is the tail. Where they've placed these kind of flyer hips at the back of the fin gives you a release point. We would, um, we, I would recommend surfing it as a twin fin. Um, some of the boys here have tested it as well because we very luckily got a demo a few months ago. So we have been surfing this model. Unfortunately, the demo is actually in Portugal right now with Roger. So this is a freshie. Surf it with the um, Mayhem evil twin fins even just as a twin or with the little stabilizer gives you heaps of drive and speed but it also allows the board to release so when when you're turning you get more performance than you would from a normal rounded tail board where there's no break for the water because that's what these hips are doing for you but you also get the the 20 kind of drive and that line through your turns and through your maneuvers um, this, the flatness up here means your board's gonna paddle really quickly, so you're gonna get into waves, which means that the wave range on this board is quite extensive. You can surf this in anything from kind of thigh high up to, I would say, a couple of foot overhead if it's nice and clean. Um, if it's a bit hollow, kind of thinking France beach break and stuff, it's probably gonna max out about head high, but that's still a decent sized wave, especially for a board of this ilk. Um, I believe from surfing one that these can be surfed from pretty much anyone who's had a go on a hard top board. Like they've come off the foamy, they've come off their progression, they can go either way, they know how to do basic bottom turns. If you're at that stage or above, this board is for you. You can surf this really easily, and the more you ask from the board, the more you give. The speed that the board gives you makes surfing it easier and, and more fun as well. So, um, I really, really love this board. It's one of my favorite boards. When Roger gets back, I'm for sure getting it back off of him for a few sessions, if any waves turn up in England, that is, of course. Um, these are in stock, and, and size-wise as well, you wanna kind of size it pretty much like you would your daily driver. So, um, for example, this bad boy is a 510, which is 32.2 liters. Um, so, Pretty good dims, pretty friendly dimensions with the outline and the rocker of the board. The wide point being slightly forward of center as well, gives you extra paddle speed and forgiveness in, in the way that the board surfs. But yeah, size, size it like you would your daily driver and you're just gonna find it paddles a little better, gets you in a bit earlier and you get that rocket in speed that you do because of the 20s and, the, and that loose feeling. Um, I wouldn't really say there's anything that the board can't do other than huge waves and tiny waves, but anything in between. And it's a really, really good alternative to having a thruster as your daily driver. If you're not the surfer who wants to surf really top to bottom and in the pocket, and you want a bit more ease, but a daily driver you can rely on in a huge range of waves, this acid plan is perfect for that. I can't, I can't rate it enough. We have it online at Board Shop right now. Uh, you can use finance, um, which is six months or 10 months, 0%. You could trade in your old board for one of these babies. Um, call us or email us if you have any questions at all, we can talk you through it. As I say, a couple of us now have tested it and Roger will be back and he's tested it as well. And um, 
yeah, if you need any help, reach us out, subscribe to our YouTube, like us on Instagram, and thanks very much for watching. That's the acid plan.